3D printing is a vast and ever-expanding sphere, which is ready to welcome everyone with a touch of enthusiasm and a bit of spare money. A perfect example of 3D printing accessibility is personal and professional manufacture of desktop miniatures for popular table games, such as D&D, Warhammer 40k, etc. In this video, we will cover top quality professional and semi-professional 3D printers so you can go with the device that yields great output from the start and allows growing into more complex projects further down the road. When deciding on a 3D printer for making miniatures, one should consider between the two most common and cost-effective options, which are resin and FDM-based machines. In fact, the choice greatly depends on your aims. First, note that materials for FDM printing are more affordable compared to photopolymer resins for devices based on stereolithography technology. Apart from that, models printed with resins are more difficult to post-process. Still, the total accuracy, complex geometry, and surface finish quality is better in SLA. Other than that, FDM printers offer larger build volumes, which is important for making terrain and mass production of miniatures. Overall, when choosing between these two types, it comes down to the following advice. FDM printers are best for beginners and large projects, while 3D printing experts prepared for complex operations and striving for highly detailed outputs might opt for a resin 3D printer. The first on our list is the Frozen Sonic 4K 2022, a professional LCD MSLA 3D printer with a strong frame made of metal, ensuring reduced levels of wobbling during printing. Moreover, the new version features a heater add-on to keep the resin temperature between 24 and 30 degrees Celsius. If the outside temperature gets too low, the resin can become viscous, resulting in low-quality or failed prints. In addition, there is an air purifier to minimize undesired odors commonly associated with resin 3D printing. Due to a custom-made monochrome LCD screen with 4K resolution and a parallel UV LED matrix featuring uniform light exposure, it is able to produce highly detailed prints at high speeds. Among other qualities, the machine features a build volume of 135 by 75 by 200 millimeters, outstanding accuracy of up to 10 microns, fast curing, 0.2 seconds per layer, and open material system expanding your creative possibilities. The Sonic 4K 2022 is extremely easy to use, which makes it a perfect device for beginners. The only downside seems to be complex cleaning procedure. With a build area of 330 by 185 by 400 millimeters, the next product by Frozen called Sonic Mega 8K is a tempting offer for large format lovers who'd like to enjoy the unprecedented resolution. For example, see the alien diorama we printed on this machine? No other printer would have allowed for this level of resolution and size. The device features high precision with a minimum layer height and XY resolution of 10 and 43 microns respectively. It guarantees finely detailed models with appealing smooth surfaces. The reliable mechanism applying a dual linear ball screw ensures stable printing and effective performance. The Mega 8K is also made of a fully metal frame, ensuring reduced levels of wobbling during printing. As the shortcoming, we can refer to the slower print speed compared to smaller 3D printers. Now let's move on to FDM-based machines. For a personal 3D printer, the high-temp version of the Creality CR5 Pro has quite a professional approach. This fully enclosed device comes completely assembled and ready to work with a variety of materials. The machine boasts a build volume of 300 by 225 by 380 millimeters and splendid print quality. Add to that a robust structure, BL Touch auto leveling sensor, a removable glass print bed, silent operation, easy to use software, and regular upgrades, and you'll get a reliable tool for any complex project. The machine has been equipped with a brass nozzle for optimized torque, an upgraded cooling system, a reliable power supply, and a sturdy Z axis system that ensures precision and stability. Also, the printer is equipped with a powerful motherboard chipset that guarantees silent performance, yet, the printer offers single extrusion only. The Chidi Tech iFast lives up to its name by enabling rapid and hassle free printing of remarkably accurate models. This industrial-grade FDM 3D printer is based on the dual extrusion technology, which lets you print water-soluble supports and multicolor models, as well as two similar objects simultaneously. The build volume depends on the print mode. It's 330 by 250 by 320 millimeters for two extruders, and 360 by 250 by 320 millimeters for one. 
Thanks to the enclosed all-metal construction and heated chamber, the Chidi Tech iFast easily handles high-temperature materials. The advanced features like a direct-drive extrusion system, detachable magnetic heat bed, wear-resistant ruby nozzle, and powerful thermal insulation provide smooth printing experience and reliable output. It should be noted that the machine is quite bulky, so be ready to make some room for it. The RAISE 3D E2 is an IDEX 3D printer making the best out of independent dual extrusion technology, capable of printing in the mirror and duplication modes. The device features a heated flexible print bed and is great for multi-material projects, while the build volume of 330 by 240 by 240 millimeters in the single extruder mode allows printing objects of decent sizes in whole. Being the first 3D printer with a dedicated video-assisted offset calibration system, the RAISE 3D E2 is a high-performance, user-friendly device for time and cost-effective production at a professional level. As for the downsides, the machine requires a bit tricky nozzle change procedure. With a massive number of 3D printers available on the market, those who want to make tabletop miniatures should first look at several crucial parameters to choose the right device depending on their preferences. First, printing fidelity. The most important aspect for miniature crafting is the printer's ability to convey all the details. It is indicated by the following factors. Nozzle diameter. Ideally, it should not exceed the standard 0.4 millimeters to print fine details, and 0.2 millimeters is even better, so search for the models with interchangeable nozzles of two or more sizes. XY precision. It is basically determined by the quality of the bearings, belts, motors, and frame. All metal construction in combination with reliable kinematics provides a stable base for high accuracy. Layer thickness. The lower it is, the more detail your model will get. With FDM 3D printers, the minimum layer thickness for detailed miniatures should be well under 100 microns. Secondly, the overall build volume. This part is very simple. With a large build chamber, you will be able to produce single massive models or a quantity of smaller miniatures. Thus, you can multiply your production volume over the same time. After all, 3D printing is generally fairly slow, so the speed of the process can be compensated by a capacious device. Just keep in mind that a bigger build volume implies a larger weight and dimensions. Third, the quality of craftsmanship. When you aim for precision, the quality of the 3D printer and its components is crucial. Here, only trusted and well-known brands with a lot of feedback should be given priority. Another question that may concern an aspiring maker is where to download miniatures to 3D print. 3D printers use model files of various formats that come from CAD software. With some skills in 3D modeling, you will be able to print your own designs through the export feature. It is also possible to scan a desired model with the 3D scanner and make a corresponding mesh for further printing. But what if you don't have 3D CAD experience and additional devices or physical models at your disposal? Fortunately, there are numerous online sources to get all types of files you might need to make minis with any convenient slicer at hand. From original, editable CAD files to printable ones. Now, let's see what the best of them are. Thingiverse, a community-fueled repository of 3D printable files, including optimized ones. There are plenty of D&D minis and a number of thematic fantasy sets. My Mini Factory, generally similar to the previous website with a free and premium versions. Moreover, it has a dedicated tabletop gaming section with a fine selection of figurines. Colts 3D, a great source of fantasy and anime designs. However, most files here are not free. Pinshape, a free or premium source with a vast selection of minis related to popular franchises. You Imagine, mostly similar to the sites described above. Kickstarter, a crowdfunding platform where you can support designers and get new models and whole sets instantly or after a while. Still, note that most of them are enthusiasts. Patreon, a subscription-based source that mostly offers a welcome and monthly packs of models from the creators you decide to support. Regardless of one's experience, everyone is sure to find an ideal 3D printer for making desktop miniatures according to their goals. After all, printing custom miniatures for popular franchises is more economical than buying them. And of course, it is an incredible experience, which might become a profitable hobby, not to mention more vivid impressions from your favorite board games. This is Top 3D Shop with a short guide on choosing a 3D printer for creating miniatures. Subscribe to our channel, leave your comments below, and hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. See you soon!